Hello, my name is Sonia. Thank you so much for checking in. This is a collective reading for the New Earth community. I hope you are doing well. Let's get started right away. Let's see what you need to know today. What's going on within your energy and within your connection? Let's see here. And you have the Two of Swords. Temperance card. The King of Cups. The Knight of Wands, Balance card, Two of Pentacles, and the Four of Cups. So right away, what I'm seeing here from you is this indecisiveness, um, the truth that you've become conscious aware of, um, you're in the state of resistance, you're in the state of waiting and um, very emotionally drained. At the moment, uh, there's things in your foundation trying to show you the way of which you are needing to break away from and it's for you to start a new beginning by making a choice, a wise choice. Um, there's There may be two decisions that you are needing to confront and to look in, in a deeper level, in a deeper way. Uh, what the temperance card is about, you working out and how to come out of a situation that has put you in the state of um, protecting your heart of not allowing others to truly know know you um, not allowing yourself to show as you as who you truly are from within um, you're stopping yourself from expressing emotion towards um, individuals or in a foundation which is now in the works of helping you recognize this and for you to truly step out of that um, pattern, which is a pattern break for you to um, show, for you to take a pattern break to, for you to take to um, speak more clearly, to um, show others what your needs are at the moment. So that is in the works for you to to recognize and to um, break this pattern of overprotecting yourself, to not get hurt or to, um, or this is like you're stopping yourself from doing things that can help you open up. So in the process you're protecting your heart so that you won't get hurt, but you're still getting hurt by not expressing yourself as who you truly are, how you truly feel, how you truly think. So this is the time where you are needing to recognize this and work through that. Um, the King of Cups is about expressing your true wants and emotions and not keep all of that in your thoughts, not keep all of that within. Um, this is about showing others of your vulnerability um, so that those circumstances or situations that you truly want and desire can come in because at the moment you're protecting yourself which is your heart which is your emotions you're not expressing your true intentions to those who you are needing to speak to of your um, of how you feel of how you think and the night of wands is something is is someone or something coming very fast um, but again watching you from afar and not taking that risk into coming forward um, I feel this is a mirror to how you are currently in this vibration this frequency of very emotionally um, aware at this moment but feeling very drained as well so the balance card is about making a choice um, choosing and going towards that direction. Um, no more waiting, standing up for your wants and desires, 
moving forward and then things will start showing up of what you truly want and desire but this is for you to take that leap of faith into how you truly feel and and what you truly desire and move moving towards that direction and the four of cups is about holding back not taking that opportunity so therefore being things will be getting delayed if you and all your counterpart aren't risking enough to move towards what you truly want and desire too much in your thoughts too much in the imagination state and not um, actually standing up to take those action steps forward so that uh, what you truly desire can come into fruition see what else you need to know and you have oppression the eight of swords happiness so again this is someone who is carrying all of these burdens and still wanting to move forward into um, these obligations, I feel that you and your counterpart are taking action into what is what your responsibilities are. Uh, but in the process, you stop for a moment and then you start recognizing that you're doing things in a in a automatic, which is detrimental because um, that realization stops you. If you continue on carrying all of these burdens, you will not move towards what you truly want and desire, but act in expectations of others. So that is why you're in this state of oppression from within. Even though you are wanting to go towards a new direction, you're not. So um, in order for you to start moving freely into what you truly want and desire, you are needing to release um, these burdens. The moment and the eight of swords is um, you're keeping yourself stuck you're able to release yourself yourself from these obligations or circumstances but you're keeping your stuff yourself stuck in that situation um protecting yourself therefore not showing any true emotions of what you desire and portraying something that you're not so if this is how you tr you feel within and you're feeling trapped, I highly suggest you book me for a mentoring session. Um, I can help you work out into your own, own circumstances and with the programs that, that you make of your choice, you get two programs for free when you book me for a mentoring session. Okay, so you also have the happiness card. This is your ultimate uh, goal at the moment this is what you truly want and desire to accomplish everything that you desire but um, I feel these um, thoughts of happiness are in your imagination state and you're not truly moving forward into them you're only imagining of what you want but not taking the action steps into what you want and with that being said you have the seven of cups which all of these wishes and desires they're all in your mental state um, which you are wanting you are needing to make a choice at this time and your counterpart shows up with the hierophant your counterpart holds the key of for you to recognize your loves and desires so with that um, the person may be also watching you from afar um, looking into how you're doing and also contemplating into what he or she is needing to take action in or release him or herself from and the ace of pentacles both you and your counterpart are needing to make a choice it's suggested for you to make a choice at this time if you truly want to break pattern and um, attract or receive everything that you truly desire with the action steps that you take not with what you think or what you feel that you want but with the action steps that you take at the moment the opportunities are there for both of you to 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 get with how emotionally um, available with how emotionally you invest in what you want and how passionately you feel for by taking the action steps and, and investment into what investment can be time investment can be in um, a pentacle way of paying for something that can benefit you 
Um, investment is the focus that you put in, into what you want to accomplish. So any kind of investment that you put in into what you truly want to accomplish or receive is what can ultimately get you into what you want and desire. And that's for both you and your counterpart to be aware of. Um, so if you want each other, you are needing to take those action steps to release yourself from following um, individuals or circumstances that are, are actually keeping you stuck in a situation that is not fulfilling you. Okay, let's get some messages from the Alien Oracle cards. These are connected with the programs that we offer here. And you have, it may seem like it's taking long, but mastery cannot be rushed. You still have more to learn. This is where you invest in these programs and um, it's suggested for you to suggested and required for you to study these programs to look into your own circumstances of how you feel of how you're doing things and how things are showing up in your reality flirt does your person know how you feel no words are needed but flirting shows you care without labels and expectations of words so no need to expect anything from your counterpart if you truly want your counterpart to know how you truly feel uh, reach out and um, have no expectations of a reply from your counterpart but show up as you truly feel for your counterpart that will change things for your benefit okay with that being said let's get messages from the alien oracle cards these may be adhere to your own wants and desires okay and you have the magnetism between us drives me insane Finances are a factor. I run out of fear that you will see the real me. I choose you. I know how much I need you in my life. I needed to make sense of this connection. And one more. You are my star that outshines all the others. So I feel these messages are from both you and your counterpart. Um, you are needing to make take those action steps forward into what you want to accomplish and what you desire in your connection and within yourself so that you can um, be in that in your journey in your path um, of what you want to uh, show up as who you truly are to others and primarily to yourself okay so i hope this reading served you well thank you so much for checking in join us in the facebook group and see you next time.